Hello, my name is Jessica. I'm going to show you how to add a spike for this dinosaur booty that I made. So basically I just followed a regular booty tutorial and now I'm adding little peacock spikes on it. And now I'm going to show you how to add the peacock spike onto a booty. And when you're done, after you got all four, it's going to look like this. So I already added two, and I like to keep the strings there, just in case I feel like I want to move it, I can still have the option to do it. So the first thing you want to do is take your crochet hook and go through the middle and find the spot you want to put your spike. Once you got it, you're going to take your yarn, your yarn doesn't have to be measured at all, just cut out like a decent size and then put the yarn over the crochet hook and now we're gonna pull one side of the yarn through the booty so now you just have one side coming out one side is through the middle and the other side is through the top now with the top piece you're gonna make a slip stitch here I'm going to slip knot, sorry. Just so that you have a base to make the peacock stitch. And then once you have that, tighten it up a little bit. And now we're going to make the peacock stitch. Um, chain of two. One, two, and now you're going to um, go through the back loop of the first chain, yarn over, pull through, and slip stitch, and that makes the peacock. And now, um, to secure it onto the booty, you're going to go through um, one of these half double crochets right next to where you're placing the um, peacock stitch, yarn over, pull through, and now we're going to make another slip stitch into that loop that has the peacock stitch. Okay, good. Now from here, just pull the extra yarn all the way through, like that, and now you're going to go back in through the center and you're going to get this piece of yarn so that you can um, fasten it or secure it, make a knot so that it stays. So take your crochet hook back through the middle, right next to the peacock stitch you just made. Get that piece of yarn. Pull it through the booty. See, sometimes it struggle a little bit with all these. There we go, I think I got it that time. There we go, yep. Pull it all the way through the middle. And now if you yank on, just tug, not yank, tug on each of those strings that you just used, it's going to adjust the spike a little bit. Just like that. And now I go in through the middle to, to that spike that we just made and I make just a single knot so that if I need to move it around I can still take it off and place it somewhere else. So just a single knot here. Good. And that's it. And then I do the fourth one, and then if I'm happy with where all of them are, then I will do a, a double knot, um, do an another knot, and then I'll snip them. So that looks just like this with this one. Just these little tiny little double knots. And you end up with that. 
and I will um, place the tutorial for this one. And then I also made this dinosaur hat, which I'll also put a tutorial for that one too. Alright, thank you so much for watching.